What's up, Funko friends and family? It's your boy McFly, the hardest working man in pop tainment today. Coming at you again with another unboxing video. If this is your first time visiting the channel, man, I welcome you. I appreciate you stopping by. Be sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell, all that good stuff to keep you up to date with what I got going on. Every day, um, I try to put up a video. A lot of the times I make it, but sometimes I don't. But if you come back tomorrow, you might see something different, you know? If not, check out the rest of the videos that I've been uploading just to hold you over. Um, we on the road to 1K, trying to get that done by the end of the year. And uh, yeah, bro, let's go ahead and get into it. We got that uh, Ric Flair, the Nature Boy Royal Rumble 1992 Down and Glitter GameStop exclusive. <coughs> that was a mouthful, man. <clears throat> that was definitely a mouthful. I'm tired. I'm, I'm out of breath. All right, back on it. So you got the box, GameStop exclusive. Diamond Glitter, Ric Flair. Um, if you don't know, I'm an avid WWE guy. I have plenty of uh, pops. There go some of them. I like burn out one, but there go some of them. Um, I got a collection video somewhere on this channel. You can check it out. It'll be there for you. This came in the mail probably yesterday, but y'all know I don't be checking my mail like that. <laughs> the mailman put a whole box in the actual mailbox. I guess he didn't feel like walking to the porch. Bottom of the box, man. We always show the boxes over here to let you guys know uh, what your pop should be looking like. If you're looking to cop off Macari or some other platform. This joint also came with a Royal Rumble pin. Let's see if I can focus in on that. Royal Rumble pin. It's just like a pin for your shirt or whatnot, you know, like you put on your clothes, a little pin, nothing too much there, and then you got Ric Flair, boom, oh, too short, the diamond glitter laid out, you kind of see the shimmer um, around the arms and the V and the chest and that robe from Royal Rumble 92, I actually had to go back and uh, find a picture, man, so I could put it in here, y'all know I'm the picture guy to compare so we'll drop that picture in in a second so y'all can check that out y'all know he had on the black coat with the sparkly silver butterflies or whatever man that thing was crucial it was fly brick on the blonde hair arms to the back back shot bottom of the feet Rick Flair is one of my favorite wrestlers however he's not in my top three <laughs> Most people older than me will be like, what, man? You crazy. And the young people younger than me are like, who's Rick Flair? You mean that old guy that's always? <laughs> oh, man, I'm clowning, bro. But, uh, yeah, man, solid pop. Actually happy to have this. Definitely going to add it to my WWE stack. Y'all know I'm on the WWE pops. Um, but that's pretty much the review, man. Y'all see he had, the, he had the big belt before it was a belt for every weight class, every division belt for every participant they got a belt for everything now the janitor belt the ring assembler belt the cameraman belt it's just it's too it's too many belts <laughs> it's just <laughs> it's too many belts but yeah that's it man short sweet to the point did you guys cop this was you rocking with it let me know in the comments man till next time it's your boy mcfly and the nature boy we'll holler at you